Bondi, the brand, as we just continue to grow, it is important, the mm-hmm. people that are part of the brand too. And we have some of the best owners. I mean, they work hard, they give a lot, um, they give back to the community. They're typically local in that community, which I think is really important. Um, and so, yeah, I've tried to be really intentional about the owners that do move forward and open yeah. up a truck. If so. someone is ha- does happen to listen to this, um, <laughs> which would be awesome, and does want a truck, and they are in a place that, that isn't you know a territory that's taken, how does that franchise model work? Yeah, so they apply online on our website, and then from there I, I send them the information, let them review it again, and to look at it in more details. Then we schedule a time to do an interview or like it's just kind of a get to know you. They ask a lot of questions. I'm able to, you know, ask questions about them, see if they're able to. Because it's at the end of the day, food trusts especially are a lot of work. It's exhausting. Um, I've had to put in so many hours of lifting things, heavy things, moving stuff around. You're working with all these different clients um, and you're with a different client each day. So you're trying to be really present with the client you're with while emailing seven clients for next week. Um, So it's just like it pulls from you in a lot of different ways. So um, I always try to lead with that. And sometimes that'll be like the deal breaker for a lot of them is that it is a lot of work. And so the operation side of it might not be what they were expecting or what they saw when they see a food truck truck. So, um, and then after that, we kind of just get started. We find the truck, we build out the territory, sign the papers. Um, and then in, once you sign the papers and we find the truck, you can be open like in two, three weeks time. Yeah. Um, cause we have everything else all sorted. I have the blenders at my house. Um, you know, everything's ready to go. We just need the truck and the, the buy-in, the signature. Yeah. So, so do you like purchase all the truck and all the equipment or did they do it? And then like, I mean, you don't have to talk about this if you don't want to, but I'm super interested in <laughs> yeah, <how it> no. <laughs> yeah, so for the trucks right now, trucks are really hard to find. Mm-hmm. Amazon has been buying them up or FedEx or whatever because there's just so many online yeah. shopping now. Um, so because of that, it's hard to find trucks. So we have started building some out on our own. So like dad actually... <laughs> My dad's a rock star. He helped build the storefront and now he's transitioning to build out food trucks so that we have a food truck when someone's ready. So, um, cool. so we have two more food trucks just sitting at my house ready to be built out. Yeah. Um, so we try to do it as best as we can. Some people opt to do it on their own and they'll go through like a custom food truck place or they'll buy it. You know, I bought mine on Facebook Marketplace and yeah. then just like redid it myself. So that's an option. And it, at the end of the day, it just comes on, comes to like how much, what kind of truck you're wanting, what the price, what your price budget is, that mm-hmm. kind of thing. So the trucks that's sitting at our house probably like aren't as reliable and more similar to mine. Mm-hmm. Whereas if you buy a brand new truck and get it built out custom, it's going to probably last longer, have a nicer engine, that kind yeah. of thing. So how much does a new truck cost with a built, like fully built out? Fully built out is probably like it depends how nice you're going. Yeah, yeah, There's yeah. like the Cadillacs of of Bondi Bowls, you know, or Cadillacs of Food Truck World, and they can be upwards of like 120, 130. Yeah, yeah. Or you can buy a used one, fix it up for like 35 to 50. I mean, <laughs> even a used one and fix it up is still a huge investment. Yeah. Right? Oh yeah. Like, it's still a huge amount of money that you know someone. But again, like that's that's you know something that you built into the franchise model and and. You know, it, it's it, it clearly there's a model. You know, you've built out a plan that it works, right? Like if right. you do this, like like a menu, if you put this together, make exactly. the calls, and and it's gonna work. And then is it obviously it's on to them then to schedule out and, you know. Yeah, that. so they do most of, they do all their scheduling. That's the best part about a food truck is you can work when you want right. to and not work when you don't want to. Um, I did just make my big corporate hire as well. So I yeah. have my first corporate employee and we start training um, this week on Tuesday actually. And his role is pretty much to sit down with all the trucks quarterly and just be like, here, here's the numbers, here's what we've done. Um, but if we made you know this many cold calls and had this much return, we could increase this much percentage right. and we could increase sales. Look, you're doing really well in this tiny little town. Let's target that town right. on your Saturdays or things like that. Um, and just giving a better outside perspective because right. when you're in the truck world, you're not thinking about those things. You're, you're waking up, you're going to the destination, you're coming home, you're going to bed, yeah. <laughs> you know? So um, he kind of just is going to be able to like, 
do big picture stuff and really help them be like, this is how much we need to make based off of your expenses to make sure you're breaking even. This is to make sure you're profiting, to make sure it's your full-time job. I have several owners that this is their full-time job now. um, And they work, you know, nine months, take three months off, which is awesome. And such an amazing platform. So I'm excited to have this um, employee with Jacoby come in and be able to like offer them all these new things and be able to to talk them through ways to right. be strategic moving forward, which is fun.